This section will focus on the skills that can be practiced using premature Anne. The head of the mannequin is placed in the neutral position and we begin positive pressure ventilations, producing realistic chest rise and fall. Prior to intubation, spray the endotracheal tube and the laryngoscope with a supplied airway lubricant. Premature Anne is being intubated with a 2.5 mm endotracheal tube. If the ET tube is placed in the esophagus, it will cause stomach distension, as demonstrated here. The umbilical cord allows for the insertion of an umbilical venous catheter with realistic flashback. The umbilical reservoir holds a maximum volume of 15 milliliters of fluids. The pre-ported peripheral IV ports of premature Anne are dry use only, with no administration of fluids. The sites allow for the insertion of a 24-gauge cannula. Here we demonstrate the use of the anticubital fossa site for the practice of insertion and securing of an IV line. Realistic compressions for newborn babies of this size can be performed on premature Anne. The nasogastric tube should be lubricated prior to insertion into the nostrils of premature Anne. An orogastric tube can also be inserted and should be lubricated prior to use. 